Hi guys, Sandy from So Easy by Sandy here and today I wanted to make a pinwheel quilt block with you. Remember when a couple of days ago I made a nine patch quilt block and told you it was the easiest block to make? We are making what I believe is the easiest and quickest quilt block to make ever. Well, I'm having second thoughts because the pinwheel block may very well be easier to make and quicker too. And if I'm honest, it just looks so darn nice. And depending on how you group it together, you can make different quilt designs, you know, so it's very versatile too. You know, just Google pinwheel quilts and see how many options you have out there. Okay, let's get to it. For the pinwheel quilt block, you will need two fabric squares. That's it, just the two fabric squares. Now to make a pinwheel like this one I have right here, which is about 5.5 inches, you will need six inch squares. Now what you'll do next is place one on top of the other, right sides together like so. And then we will sew around the four sides, effectively closing the squares. pretty weird, I know, <laughs> but it will get better in a second, okay? Now take your scissor or your rotary cutter and mat and just cut across like so. And then cut it across again. And this makes the four parts of our block. The next step is, as usual, to press our seams. Now, like I've said, you can align your pieces in different ways, like this, for example. But for me, a pinwheel, that's a pinwheel, looks like this. I absolutely love this look, you know, it's so simple and striking at the same time. Okay, now let's sew it together. And there you have it, our pinwheel quilt block, ready to be joined with other pinwheels and make a lovely quilt or blanket top. What do you think? Quick and easy, right? Is there a quicker or easier quilt block you can think of? If so, leave me a comment below letting me know what it is. <laughs> and I will see you soon, bye bye!